All right, we back, boy. Let's see what we have. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do this for a second. Here we go. It is creepy. Are these our friends? Take the Aurora back to the safe zone and sit Oh yeah, 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 this is our train. Right. <laughs> My mistake. You're in charge while I'm away. Sorry, yes, sir. Great. Let's go. This is a bad place. Now we shouldn't have come here. Really? Okay, so where's my welcoming committee and red carpet? I don't get this. Oh, see? Nobody home. How about we go back? Huh? Bye. <gasps> Look! Identify yourself. Colonel Miller, here to report to the Minister of Defense. And where are your people, Colonel? <sighs> it's dangerous outside. Contact them and tell them to take the train into the main airlock for decontamination. Welcome oh no. To the arc, Colonel. Proceed through the tunnel and That's take about the elevator. It, yeah. You'll be met inside. <laughs> See? We expect you. 
<coughs> that this is a bad idea. No even sound effect for opening door. Oh my god. Comrade Minister, Commander of the Joint Special Operations Forces, Squadron of the City of Moscow, Colonel Miller, reporting. I would like to request that my people are provided with temporary quarters and supplies, as there are women and children among us. Still, our fighters are in top shape and ready for action. Women and children? <laughs> Good. Haven't had those in a while. Who are you? Yeah, I knew, I knew that, 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 that's about to happen. Imagine if I would have had an A-Bot and just killed everyone. <laughs> Just fine, and even better. The minister and the chief himself are expecting you for dinner. Dinner? What the hell? Are you fucking mocking me? Shut up! The doctor is talking. Where is the government answer? All here, Colonel. All here. We are the government you people deserve. Don't you dare, you fuck! You're just... You're just fucking cannibals! Calm down, we'll get John this like this. And believe me, nobody likes that bitter taste. The girl will have to wait, though. We must run the tests first. I don't like that cough of hers. Untie my hands, you motherfucker! And I'll shove those tests so far up your ass, you'll be spitting Watch them. your tone, young lady. Do as that young man does. 
He woke up long ago, but quietly listens to wise people talk. Uh, you fucker! Let me... let me go! Not a single! So, Colonel, now you will pick up the radio and tell the rest of your people and the train to come here. If you don't want her to suffer for a really long time before she is served. Do you understand? And here I was hoping for an intelligent conversation for a change. Alas. That's not a problem, though, since this nice young man will surely do it instead. He won't dare be contradictory once we're done with you. Well, nice meeting you and all. Yakov, you may start. I'll get you even after I'm dead. That may well happen, Colonel. I could choke on you or something. In the meantime, I'll excuse you myself. Come here, I'll rip you all apart. Every last one of you should have done that before the war. When I get to live, burn this town to ashes. Long time since you died. Now we'll be full again. Good. Dude, what is this place? They don't even have any guns. Out of ammo. Oh, I got all my ammo back. Look at that. This way, we can hope to find Anna. Still, the complex is huge, and we have ten minutes at the most. So, we'll have to split up. Sam, you check the filter room, the generator hall, and the storage. Idiot, you come with me to the command center. Artyom, you take the barracks and the sick bay. Oh yeah.
On my way. New note. I just lucked out missing the consortium milestone was the best thing ever after all. Tefenge was so upset about the stupid bonus. What does Pile of Ash need bonus for? Now we have it made. The government didn't arrive after all, so all the complex is ours with all of its stores. The, the bunker was supposed to save a whole town and there's just a couple of thousand of us. The only problem is in the babe... The babe department? But we'll just wait till the radiations dis dissipated and calmly walk down the mountain, or rather crawl up from under it. Some fucking luck. The government didn't arrive for a reason, after all. The thing is, someone did a better number on food reserve budget than on the construction one. We did manage to build the thing, even if flayed, but the stores are empty. Sure thing, all quartermasters are crooks and they had it coming. But the vessels were telling the truth. After all, the shelves are empty. Well, there are some seeds and pasta, but that shit won't last us even a year. Oh, they have guns. Alright, then I think that's about it. There shouldn't be any more of them. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm doing what I can, okay? Chill down. They're literally cannibals. Yeah, I think I need a... Oh, I can take a shotgun, can I? Oh no, I can't. Oh. Hmm. 
How many how many meds do you have? Four, okay. This more than enough. They're literally cannibals, oh my god, oh lord. Wait, is that an AK? Kinda go here, kinda. You know, everyone just sits still, the stomach doesn't even bother me anymore, good thing I don't listen to the fools about drinking a lot. Will last at least a week more, John swollen hard to write. I don't think I can write about this, but I must, they made a soup a week ago, five idiots in the barrack killed over at once, they gobbled it up and burst their gut, I couldn't touch it for a day, then I tasted a bit at night and hurled immediately, but in the morning it tasted like chicken. At least I can ride again. Thought it was a goner for sure. Wait, am I not, I'm not supposed to go here? Huh.
Oh my lord. So it almost feels like they're holding these people like it's almost their home but they need to kill in order to survive. That is so fucked up. Yeah, I need to go this way. Wait, can I can I go upstairs? I don't think I can actually go upstairs, so Some of them have weapons, but most of them don't. Nice game, by the way. Wait, do I need to go there? Hold your horses, I'm still looting! Oh, another book. Fucking let them in, fucking fuck the radiation, it's been over a year. The outsiders don't even need a share, let them draw lots or whatever the point is, we'll have food for months now. Hurt all over, fever, thoughts tingling, talk said shit about some prevents or something. The outsiders had them, the fucks should have roasted. Them fucks better. Too late now, fuck. Oh. You're losing your shit, dude! This fucking recall, dude.
Dude, one of those motherfuckers threw a goddamn Molotov at me. Are you goddamn serious? Yeah, I need to start looting less, cause... <laughs> I, I loot a lot. Like, I, I just like to explore in games, I don't know. That's a long way to go. <clears throat> Holy moly, what I need. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm a retard. How is he not dead? I killed this guy, dude. Put your weapon on the floor and step out of the hole or hide. 
blending in. Take this. How do I kill him? <laughs> That's li it literally it does nothing. What am I supposed to do? Uh, oh my lord. What am I supposed to do? How do I counter him? Wait, where, where, where did it go? Yo, what what do I do? I know you're here, pal. and that means you're shit on the block, eh? I don't know what to do. I don't think I can kill him. Does he have any weak spots? I don't know, like I... I'm gonna take this gun and I'm gonna replace this gun with uh, this gun. Thank you very much. I have a feeling. Wait, can I upgrade this? Oh shit. Activated. Oh, this is my weight. Wait, can I can I have my AK? Oh, this is a... Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, I don't know if I want this gun, honestly. Yeah, no, 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 I don't want that gun. There's a lot of crazy motherfuckers in this place. I ain't gonna lie.
That look that looks fucked up. New no, note. No. Officer's diary. It's been a month already since we became rats in a hole here, and what do we have to show for that? We don't even know if anyone's still alive out there. All the antennas were destroyed and the radiation levels are so high there's no way to fix them. Though even the antennas were okay, would anyone have a reason to contact us? The big rigs never arrived after all. Looks like the construction workers arrived, though we would better get ourselves comfortable here as we're in, a, in for a long run. The city is with that council of theirs. I would forgive the workers if they came up with a, with, a, with bullshit like that. But why would be? But why would the officers want to play those games? Just to be able to push the blame on the government decree. I don't know if that's pronounced. If you pronounce it like that, when they cut the ra rotate ra <coughs> ra rations, rations, rations again. How is it supposed to help if there simply are no food reserves no matter what? Lunacy. The doctor is right. We the radio technicians are here for a reason. We will not will not just save our comrades. We will also help thousands of survivors outside. The only thing we need to do is fix the antenna so that the real government know we're alive. They will send us food shipments and then our project will provide a shelter from their rad radiation for all survivors. And what could be more important now? Oh, so this is not Oh, so actually the real government exists, I assume? That would make a lot of sense. Yeah, wouldn't be surprised if, like, the real government actually exists. Oh, Anna! Artyom! I knew! Behind you! There is always one like you! A hero! You're not saving anyone! Just like the others! So just... Freeze! Yes, yes! Let just, him just go! Don't kill me! Now! Uh, remember what I told you! There was an ex... Oh! Enough chatter! I think he had something important to say. Are you alright, Artyom? Thank God. Let's report to the colonel. There is an experiment, isn't there? What kind of what kind of experiment? What experiment? There's an elevator straight down the corridor. It goes right to the command center. Let's go. Not too fast though. I need to catch my breath a bit. What kind of an experiment is he was he talking about? <laughs> Officer's diary too. Nothing can be done, they have five days at most. At least doctor says he can at least give them something for the pain. Who could have known they would go up there to fix the antennas? Boys should have told me you should have at least won the suits. It's up. I just sent the first message. Made it. The boys are still alive. Alasha even smiled when I told him. At least now they'll know they didn't die in vain. So I get the radio online and they remove me immediately. I can't even get any news. They say it's all secret. Put guards at the door to the bastards. And they struck me from a special r rations distribution list. Way to reward honest effort. This is terrible. How did they... I will survive all this time. It's only been two weeks. Already I can't think of anything but food. Theirs had been getting the same ro ration for months. 
Two more weeks, the legs are getting swollen. The workers told me I drink too much. I have no energy to move. Even writing feels like hard work now. Apathy. At least the hunger's a bit blunted now. They are here. They heard us and came. Yes, they're just refugees, but they're here. Soon we will get the supplies. It's not too late yet. Everything will be fine now. Of course, the refugees are quarantined for now, but soon I'll be able to ask them about everything. I heard the quarantine will last longer than we thought. They brought some bug with them. They also brought rations, though we've been given meat broth for now. We couldn't stomach anything heavier anyways. What a great feeling, though. Whole body feels warm and taste unforgettable. I don't get this. A second group of refugees, they also brought supplies, but it's just meat. No brains or anything. And they're all quarantined too. Well, the last group has been there for over a month now. We haven't been told a thing about the situation in the country. Or the government. Or the government. Why? Let's have a frank conversation with the doctor. He will obl oblige. Ob oblige? Is that how you say it? Oblige? For the old friendship's sake. Situation, though. I thought we wouldn't see anything worse than that cult on the Volga. And that Silentius with his damn fanatics. <sighs> but no. It appears there was still space for growth. We could have gotten killed there. We almost got eaten here. That bastard. Unbelievable. To think he used to be a doctor. Don't matter. We'll see what happens now. We did survive him, after all. It's Caspian 1, a comm center. There's one more just like that in Novosibirsk. <laughs> Are you going to drag us to some other bunker now? I don't know, Anna. We have to make the decision to get Did you get everything you could, idiot? We're leaving. One moment. I'll finish breaking everything here. Come on, come on! Okay, all done. If it is right, our journey was not wasted after all. After all, the, sat the satellite Im images the tailing radioactive pollution level promise hope of finding a new home, not just for us, but for every survivor. We just need to collect these those maps. But, we but first, we have to get back to the Aurora. Okay. I don't think you should have put it like that, Anna. It all worked out this time, didn't it? Can you stop being so pushy. My concern is what if next time it doesn't. You're right, of course. But you intend to live forever? <laughs> of course. All the more reason to strive and spend more time with what is allotted to me with that guy over there. I don't know that. <laughs> that I understand. Oh, 
Another notebook. Office Diary 3. Unbelievably hideous and inconceivable monsters. So this is why nobody's been released from their quarantine, and the fucker has the gal to offer me an officer to join the ranks again. So first they throw me out, and now want to be back. And they're not afraid, not in the in the slightest. This means everything's over it up here. I don't even need to check the radio. There is there is no government, no law, and no country. Still, does that give the right to butcher and eat people? It didn't take much for them to become gals. Well. Well, just you wait. I'll teach you fair again. I still have my gun, luckily. Just wait. I'll show you how the solution to the supplies problem you hell spawn. I can't hit for shit. Isn't this the same place where we finished before? Where, where we were before? The, the last time we played the fucking Metro? 2000... 2000 fucking 33? There are so many of them, holy sh... I mean, look at the bright side, at least they will have a lot of food now. <laughs> oh, to think I believed those pricks from Hansa. I believed that Moscow was controlled by the HQ. That we were under occupation. That we were still in war. That there were generals here giving orders. What an idiot, Suka. I will repeat my question. What do we do now? Could we go back to Moscow? Tell them the truth about the war. The government. They'll shoot us on approach. And even if we do break through, what can we do against Hansa? Who'd believe us with no proof? <laughs> what about going back to Volga? We could live there. What do we do about the locals? They weren't exactly happy to see us there. Do we kill them all? Is anybody here up for that? Back in Moscow, Artyom had been dreaming of finding a habitable place and building a colony there. Isn't it time we got to it? The idea is good. But how do we find the place? Just keep traveling? The Aurora needs an overhaul. <coughs> what do we do if it breaks down? Satellites. What satellites? You want to leave the fucking planet? There's a satellite communication center on the Caspian Sea. It survived the war. Oh. <coughs> if we gain access to the data collected by the satellites... We won't have to travel randomly. <coughs> Radiation level maps, even your regular satellite photos could really help us out here. That's an idea. What if there is something worse than cannibals there? <coughs> Could well be. But first, we're going to be really careful this time. And second, does anyone have any better ideas? I don't. Well, I guess we've got ourselves a new plan. Artyom, 
Shall we look for that place you wanted? Sound the horn then. 